Now, bigger and more powerful flying drones are slowly entering everyday life. At this year's International Technology Show in Dubai, a number of drone manufacturers displayed machines that could substantially increase the mobility of various public services from police and firefighters to taxis. VOA's George Butich explains. Once it is certified for flying, this quadcopter will allow police officers in a congested city to avoid traffic jams and quickly reach their destination. It reaches speeds of 70 kilometers per hour and can go as high up as we want. But for safety purposes, we have it programmed to reach heights of 5 meters. In a country with a large number of fast cars, speed can be critical. So Dubai police are testing a battery-powered bike with a top speed of 200 kilometers per hour. The bike has eight cameras and a 360-degree view. It will be used to issue traffic fines and spot cars with an impound ticket issued against them. Firefighters also see the potential benefits of unmanned flying drones. This one is designed to fly both horizontally and vertically. You, you are the first one hearing about this autonomous drones at the moment and it will be official launch for it within two months from now. Yeah. Moving to public transport, developers say in the near future two-seater taxi drones like this one will be transporting passengers who want to avoid traffic jams. Its cruising speed will be about 50 kilometers per hour at a maximum altitude of about 200 meters. City departments coordinating all this traffic may someday be equipped with a giant interactive wall for quick access to valuable data. The movement of the metro, the buses, uh, accidents, um, uh, uh, hospital occupancies, uh, uh, ranking of schools and uh, availability in different schools, um, availability of uh, homes uh, and uh, apartments, um, location for uh, entrepreneurs to move or expand their, uh, uh, their uh, businesses. It's hard to say when all these new technologies will actually be deployed in real life, but developers at the Dubai Technology Week exhibition express strong confidence that it will happen very soon. George Putich, VOA News.